Joining our Uyo studio where we will be discussing uh, the economic hardships in the country and ways of protecting consumers from unfair uh, practices. Joining us from our Uyo studio is Professor Atanda Orebi, who is an economist. Hello and good morning, Prof. Hello and good morning. It's wonderful to have you join us on Morning Express today. Well, I believe uh, uh, we will be looking to establish, uh, re-establish connections with Professor Orebi in a short while. We will also uh, be joined live in the studio by Sa uh, Salaudin Hashim, who is the Director of Programs Clean Foundation to speak on uh, these particular issues surrounding cons uh, consumer protection uh, at a time when Nigerians are grappling with a lot of hardship. Well, let's uh, see if we have Prof back on the line. Hello and good morning, Professor. Yeah, good morning. Um, thank you for having me this morning. Um, I'm Dr. Paul at Andar already. Uh, just a way of correction. Well, it's a, it's a good pleasure morning. to have you join us uh, on the studio, or uh, in the studio from our uh, your studios. Let's uh, speak about the firstly your reaction to uh, recent statements coming in from uh, former head of state General Abdul Salami Abubakar making a call to President Bola Ahmed Tinubu to ensure that he ends the hardship biting really hard on the backs of Nigerians. It's, it's important. It's, it's, it's a call that is quite um, timely and there's no other time you know, to make that uh, such a call uh, because Nigerians are truly and really suffering. So, and it's essential that the man on the driver's seat, you know, should do something very, very urgent to ease the body, you know, on Nigerians. Because uh, there is no one, there's no, no one today that is not feeling the pain. Hello, Prof. So that call is timely. Hello, that call I can is barely essential. hear you. And I think the president should do, do something, something urgently, urgently about, about it, it to alleviate it. The of Nigerians. Thank, Thank you. you. All right. Well, well let, let, let's move on. Um, a, a lot of Nigerians might argue that perhaps it appears that the presidency isn't really keen on ensuring that um, they bring an end to or a sustainable end to the hardship uh, on Nigerians, rather resorting to palliatives, as we have seen in the case of, um, you know, the rise, thousands of bags of rice that have been sent out uh, to states as a means of curbing the hunger in this in the country, and as well as the federal government's initiative to sell um, a 50 kg bag of rice to civil servants for 40,000 naira, uh, is perhaps the issue of palliative a non-sustainable um, solution to this age-long issue? Yeah, if I if if I'm actually following you because the um, communication is break seems to be breaking. Um, the idea uh, behind the um, palliatives in this, this current situation, situation that Nigeria is, uh, I don't think I don't think is 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 actually the thing to do um, because uh, I mean how many how, how many bags of rice. Will, will the government sell to Nigerians? I mean, to uh, that will go round. So I think the fundamental thing should should really be done uh, by going back to the drawing board. You see, as far as I'm concerned, uh, if I've taken the wrong decision at some point, and uh, I now happen to see the impact of, of that wrong decision. I mean, common sense just <laughs> inform me. I mean, just change, turn it again. You know, because the, the, the president made a statement at the beginning of his uh, 
regime, uh, and that is what we are still suffering from. Fuel subsidy, you know, is gone. You know, uh, and uh, and uh, that, that brought, brought us to where, where we, are, we are. You know, you know. so, so and uh, not only about fuel subsidy. Uh, fuel subsidy was set to 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 have gone, gone. and, and uh, the, the Naira, Naira was also, also floated. floated. Uh, so, so those, those two, two major, major actions, actions were the reasons why we are where we are, we are today. today. So, so the, the president needs to do something very seriously about it in order to return Nigeria economy to where it was, you know, and uh, at least stabilize the system. Uh, it's, it's not, not just, just about, about releasing whatever, whatever number of bags of rice to civil servants at whatever price. Even, even at the 40,000 40, naira, minimum wage is 70,000. 70, so, so as me, I, I'm able to even buy a bag of rice at 70,000. I mean, at 40,000. What about every other thing? You know, that the an average house would need to attend to. So, so I, I, think, think, I think I think I think we should look beyond the idea, the idea of the of the of the palliative and look for a long-term long measure, measure, you know, that, that will alleviate the suffering, you know, on Nigerians because the the the, the, the palliative will not go far, you know, in, to, to, to alleviate the, the burden, you know, upon Nigerians. Nigerians. Thank you. Now, now, Dr. Arebi, a, a lot of Nigerians might be wondering. Uh, Due to the recent statement by Nigeria's Apex Bank, the Central Bank of Nigeria, that Nigeria's foreign reserve uh, or the removal of fuel subsidy is drastically affecting Nigeria's foreign reserve, which stands at about uh, 34.8 billion US dollars, a considerably low amount of money compared to Nigeria's GDP and the status of Nigeria in the world. I believe the layman might not really understand why fuel subsidy removal is affecting our foreign reserve and the impact that it has on the lives of common or common Nigerians. Firstly, how would you explain this to somebody listening to us right now? The conversation. Uh, but if I'm getting you right, uh, talking, uh, talking about, about the connectivity, connectivity between, between uh, the, the low foreign, foreign reserves, you know, and uh, and, uh, and the floating of, um, um, I mean, removal of subsidy or something. something. Uh, don't, don't forget, forget that, that um, it's, it's not, not just, just the subsidy, subsidy removal alone, alone that, that is the issue here. Yeah. The US US subsidy, subsidy removal, you know, then the floating of the foreign exchange. The floating of the foreign exchange is, 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 is a major, it's a major, you know, uh, uh, issue. Uh, remover. remover. Uh, so, so because, because the, 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 the truth actually is that, that there, there was, was no reason, no justification for the floating of the currency. There is no serious nation anywhere in the world that, that will throw its our currency you know, to, 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 to the whims and caprices of, a, of, a, of, a, of a, a free market. market. I mean, I mean even, 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 even the, the, the most advanced, advanced market, market economies economy that we are copying, I mean, I mean they, are they are not doing, doing it. it. Uh, America, uh, America, America didn't throw their dollar you know, to the, to the, the free wheels of, of the market. market. So, so the, the, the dollar, dollar is, 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 a, is a, the, 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 the exchange rate of the dollar, you know, vis a vis other currencies, is managed by the Federal Reserve. You know, and, and we, we ought to also do the same thing, thing. Because, because our, our currency is our, our dignity, is our pride. So by, so by the time, time we, we throw that, that away, away, for whatever, whatever reason, reason, I mean, I mean we, we are, are not doing ourselves any good service. service. So, so that's, that's the major, major that's the major, major, major problem, problem because, because and, and, and in, in a country where you know productivity has been low, productivity has been low. I mean, a lot of firms, you know, you know, have left. Some are still living. You know, bringing down productivity, uh, foreign exchange is 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 floated. You know, uh, and uh, and uh, you don't have you don't have the the, the 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 supply line. You know, good enough to meet the demand of the of the of the of the, of the, of the, of the, of the 
of the of the, of the forex uh, 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 market. So, so the central, central bank, bank will need, need to be, you know, you know uh, filling, filling the gap, the gap you know, by, by bringing, bringing the, 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 the funds, funds, you know, into the, the market. market. Where will where, 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 where the central bank get the funds on? So, so obviously, obviously, even, even if, if they, they don't, don't say it, it I mean, they, they will, will be, be going, going to the reserve to, to, to pull out from there to, to fill the gap. So then, Reserve, 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 reserve is now, is now depleted. depleted. So, so you, you can, can understand, understand the simple arithmetic. It's just, just common, common sense, sense for anybody to understand the simple arithmetic. arithmetic. Yes, yes. removal of subsidy was, 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 was not a good thing. thing. You know, that, that was, was done, done at that time. time. You know, uh, and, and uh, coupled with the uh, uh, flow of, of the exchange rate is the reason why we are where we are, where we are, where we are, where we are, you know. So the government needs to return to the drawing board. That's, that's, that, that, that's, that's my take. So in, if in I, return, if I in returning to the drawing board, uh, Dr. Orebi, uh, uh, let's talk about some service providers in Nigeria who charge people in foreign currency for services, in dollars, in, in pounds, in euros. And they are situated right here, in fact, right here in Abuja. But we, we have seen uh, companies who charge in dollars, thereby pushing the dollarization agenda that has been going on in the country where it appears that our entire economy is solely dependent and at the mercy of the dollars. How do we address this issue and ensure that Naira is supreme in Nigeria? And, and, and it, no, 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 no serious, serious government, government should allow, allow that. that. You see, the, the dollarization of the Nigeria economy should be stopped. stopped. We should, we should do, do everything, everything possible, possible to stop dollarizing the Nigerian economy. economy. Dollar, Dollar is not our national, national currency. currency. And, 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 uh, and uh, we, 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 we need, need to, to do everything, everything to promote, promote the Naira. Naira. You know, that's, that's our dignity. dignity. That's, that's our that's our, that's that's our pride. pride. You know, you know we, we need to do it. So, if you, you find people, people uh, 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 transacting in dollars, you know, you know the, the, uh, only, uh, only you know, everywhere. No, no, no government should do something. Those are things that government government should do do something about. You know, this is not America. So we don't we don't spend like our central bank doesn't issue dollars. You know, so why should transactions you know be be carried out in dollars? No, it's, 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 in fact, it should be a crime. It should be an economic crime. You know, he, he, uh, uh, he, he, if I'm, I'm allowed to, 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 say, to say that, you know, the government needs to do. You, you want, if you, you want to, you want to uh, 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 find a way, you know, to stop the, the pain of Nigeria. Then you block all avenues. Block all our venues that uh, have, have the potential, the potential of uh, uh, aggravating the, this, this problem. problem. So, so it is not, not right to dollarize the Nigerian economy. And, and I think, think whoever is behind, behind it, it, you know, whoever they are, they, they should, should rethink. rethink. And, and, and the, the government, government should do, should use the, 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 the power available to, 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 to them, them, you know, to, to call them to order and check the excesses. In Nigeria, please. Buy, buy and sell. sell. We, we buy, buy and sell, sell in Naira, not, not in dollar. dollar. Thank, Thank you. you. Well, 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 Doctor, how would you react to the uh, recent FAC allocation drop by 11.4% uh, to all three tiers of government, uh, which is well over 150 billion Naira? Uh, this is also coming um, at the wake of daunting hardship in most parts of the country where it is becoming more and more unbearable for Nigerians to survive and you know carry out their day-to-day -day activities without having to you know cry of severe hardship what what does this mean for the three tiers of government especially people at the grassroots the local government areas um, um, drop, drop in the in the in the, in the, the fact allocation, allocation. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, uh, of course, in the in the in the in the in the face of doing doing uh, resources uh, because they share what is available, you know, uh, and um, as long as our productive capacity, you know, uh, keep going down. Uh, all, 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 and and don't, don't forget, forget Nigeria is a mono, it's a mono product uh, economy technically because uh, uh, everything you know uh, dances around the, the dollar, uh, and and uh, and of course we also know that uh, 
the, we, we, we don't, don't even fix the price of the dollar because the price of the dollar is fixed by a cartel. You know. so, 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 so we basically we really have, have no serious, serious control, control over, over a lot of these things. So, so any time you know, uh, the, price the price of oil is affected, is affected globally, and revenue is affected. So uh, every, all the parties involved you know, should know this. So if the revenue drop, you know, you know in, in the, the pool, pool then, then the whatever is available for sharing will also drop. drop. So, so it's just it's just a very, very simple, simple truth. truth. You know. You know. But, but, but you see what, what? carry on doctor. Very, very crucial, crucial is that, that there is need, need to return to, return to the drawing board, board and, and expand, expand the productive base of the Nigerian economy. economy. If, if we want, want to have more money, money to spend then we, we need, need to produce, produce more, you know, and, and earn more. more. Otherwise, Otherwise, without any, you know, you there will be no, no additional money, money to spend. And you, you can't earn when, when you don't produce. produce. So, so that's, that's why, why we, we need, need to go back to the drawing board. That, that is the only solution. solution. I, mean, I mean, there, there is, is no other, other pre 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 prescription. prescription. Because, uh, I mean, <laughs> as, 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 as it is, you know, there's, there's no magic that will be, will be done, you know, to increase the amount in the, in the, in the, in the vault. If, if, the, if the price of work globally, you know, uh, are dropped. So, so the various parties, you know, uh, 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 tiers of government, you know, will adjust accordingly. And again, uh, um, yeah, yeah, whatever is allocated, we know is expected to trickle down, you know, to, uh, to, to everyone. But you know, to what extent does this really even trickle down? You know, so, like, so we need to re rebuild and, uh, and, uh, and uh, reorganize ourselves for many fronts in order to confront the hydra headed monster, uh, which is facing Nigeria. Thank you. Well, well let's uh, also uh, look at the issue of. Um, Pricing now narrowing it down to marketplaces, narrowing it down to uh, you know goods and services that uh, day to day Nigerians you know transact in. A lot of people would um, agree that due to the removal of fuel subsidy and the spike in fuel pump price, many service providers have skyrocketed their prices, and some of them have done it to an extent where it's almost unbearable for Nigerians. How do we checkmate this to ensure that consumers or customers are not ripped off due to the claim that the dollar is high and fuel price is also high? You know, you know it's, it's, diffi it's, it's difficult. difficult. This, this is, is the vicious, vicious cycle. cycle. <laughs> it's, 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 it's difficult because, because um, all, all, all prices, prices, you know, goes, goes up. up. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, you, you know, know everything, everything is, is driven by energy. energy. Everything, everything. 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 And, and the only source of energy is this fossil fuel for, for now. Uh, everything, everything, you know, revolves around, around it. Uh, uh, even, even the, the, even the, the farmer, farm. yeah. we, we need, need to transport his goods from, from the farm, you know, to the market. Who is going to help him do this transportation? The transporter, who we need to buy the fuel. You know, you know, and, and uh, by, by the time, time they, they go, go to the uh, 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 pump, pump to buy the fuel at a thousand, thousand three hundred per liter, some, some buy at a thousand four hundred per liter. You know, you know uh, because, uh, because uh, I mean, yes, yesterday we enter filling station and uh, we paid a thousand three hundred. So, 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 so you can, can you can. So for for a, for a, for a transporter. transporter if, look, look, nobody, nobody goes into, into business, business uh, as, as a father Christmas. Christmas. There's, There's nobody, nobody in business, no entrepreneur is a father Christmas. Christmas. Everyone, Everyone in business is in business because they want to make profit. profit. Okay? okay? So, so uh, and, uh, if the cost, you know, you know of, of running the operation, the operation is, is so high to him, he will definitely think, think of how to recoup, not only recover the cost, but also, you know, make his own profit. Which, Which is expected. expected. So, so the basic, the, the, the bottom line, line is, is that, that is that government need to do something very important and very serious and very urgent about this uh, pump price of, of fuel. Okay. okay. So, so there's no two way about it. As long as we continue the way we are going, 
you know, you know and, and uh, uh, time, time and again, the, 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 the bond, bond price of where will change, change, maybe from, from another announcement from NNPC. NNPC. You know, you, you, it's, it's, it's difficult to, to, to stop, stop the poor uh, Nigerian who are trying to survive. To survive. Uh, somebody, somebody is riding, riding motorbike, he wants, wants to survive. survive. You know, by the time, or riding keke, he wants to survive. Or he's driving, he's a small bus, he wants to survive. So by the time he buys the four hundred thousand four hundred, you know, per liter into his car, uh, how do you expect him, you know, to to meet up? So he will transfer it to the commuters. We transfer it to them. That's what is happening. What, what, so, well, the, Dr. Uh, Dr. Reddy, uh, not, not disputing the fact that uh, certainly the cost of production or or the cost of transportation or logistics in in uh, the services goods and services industry could be the main major cause of this spike in price. However, in every institution, in every industry, there are bad eggs. How do we checkmate these bad eggs and ensure that what they are doing, the prices that they are rolling out, are not way overpriced, you know, against uh, how much it really should be? How do how do we checkmate the bad eggs? I don't think so. You know, you know because because, because you, you, you 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 and, and, and it's, it's difficult, difficult to determine. determine. It's, it's difficult, difficult to determine because, because if, if you are selling, selling pricing your own uh, commodity, commodity, putting price, price on your own commodity, commodity. you know, you, uh, you, you must, must have, have done, done that because, because taking, taking into consideration, consideration the cost. The cost you know, uh, 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 in uh, in uh, bringing that product to the market. market. So, so you, you know, know that. Cost. I would not know whatever the cost is to you. you. Uh, uh, so, so and, and no other person, person will know whatever the cost is to another person. person. So, so that, that's, that's why it's difficult, difficult to determine who is ripping who off. So, so, I mean, I, mean, I, think, I think the government should just do the right thing, by like taking responsibility and, and ensuring these basic uh, uh, um, uh, variables, you know, are behaving uh, uh, well, you know, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and they are stabilized. If they are stabilized, you know, all of these other ones, you know, will, will, will cure, you know, and, uh, and uh, then if things go out of hand, uh, maybe we can now begin to identify where the excesses, you know, are coming from. Then we will know where to put the blame, and the people will know what to do. But as I did moment as at this moment is difficult to is difficult because because you can't tell somebody who is selling uh, 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 a, a product that costs him um, maybe 10 naira to bring to the market you can't add, tell him not to not to add two naira you know, you know and of course by the time he's adding that don't forget when leaving the market he's going to pay Pay transport, pay transport to go, to go back, back home. home. So, so you also, also need to, to add that. that. So by the time he's returning home, you know, he, he has, has a family that, that is waiting to be fed. Right. You know, so, so, this, so, so this, that's, that's why I said the vicious cycle. cycle. So, so all, all, all of these things, all of these things, you know. So putting the blame right, I mean, you can't blame the poor Nigerians that is trying to survive. So I think the blame should be placed where it belongs. It is the responsibility of government, you know, to do the right thing. Because all of this started from government policy. From the statement made by the president that subsidy was gone. You know, that is springboard, all of these things. So, and if this problem is going to be corrected, then, then the, president the president should return, return to the drawing board, board you know, and, and put the aces where they belong. belong. Thank you. Well, well, well in, in ensuring that the president well, well, returns well, well, to, the, in to the drawing the board, uh, uh, the wife of the president and first lady of Nigeria, Senator Olure Mitinubu, uh, yesterday launched what uh, she described as Young Farmers Club of Nigeria. Now in attendance was vi wife of the vice president as well as the Kwara State uh, go uh, wife of the Kwara State governor and uh, of course Abubakar Kari who is minister of agriculture and food security in the country. Now th th it's also coming at a time when people are being encouraged to go into agriculture and grow their own foods. On one hand, it is a good initiative, but on the other hand, it sort of appears as if uh, the government in itself is incapable of ensuring that the food crisis in the country is forestalled. Forestalled. Yeah, um, yeah, it is it, good, you know, to encourage uh, uh, Nigerians, you know, 
uh, to get involved in uh, agriculture. It is it's, uh, in order to uh, boost um, food production. Yeah, it's, 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 it's important. It's important to do that, you know. Um, but, you know, again, our agriculture for very many years. Don't forget that um, before the advent of oil, ag used to be you know, a uh, major earner of foreign exchange. But during the days of the granite pyramids and all, you know, uh, for petrodollar. And uh, this, is, this is where we are because of that. Uh, so uh, if we are going to put things right, and we are going to do things correctly, uh, so agriculture actually uh, deserves to be given is the right for attention. So, so and um, um, so, so encouraging, encouraging people to go to farm, farm you know, encouraging people to be involved in agriculture, you know, uh, is, 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 is good. But you see, the type of agriculture that will build us out of where we are is not just the subsistence uh, uh, farming. You understand? We need large-scale mechanized farming, uh, which which will require a lot, you know, uh, of uh, of uh, of uh, investment. And, uh, and uh, 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 for, for which, for which uh, the, the, the government still have a very serious role to play. Because uh, if, 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 if uh, Nigerians were going to make a nice farming, uh, which, which is going to require a lot, you know, uh, that means that they need to have access to funds, you know, and uh, if you are going to, if you are going to uh, access funds to invest in agriculture, of course, that funds must be is not is not, not uh, the 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 at uh, the, uh, the kind of exchange rate, rate you know uh, uh, that's uh, what, what you know will be, will be, will be so, so high. high. So it, it should be special special, special fund, fund and the, and the, the rate the rate should be very special. Also, also bear in mind that, that uh, for agricultural investments investment, you need uh, moratorium products for the crops, crops you know to grow you know before you get to the market, market before you start making uh, returns from, from them. them. So, so those are those are the those are the things those are the things. I I I think a holistic plan need to be put in place. It's, it's not, not just, it's not just, just it's not something that will come out of a jamboree, you know, of just, uh, just, just tongue lashing it, you know, and, uh, but a serious plan, a serious plan needs to be put on board, how this is going to be done. We used to have river basin development authorities, you know, um, um, uh, and uh, a lot of agencies that, over, that oversee, uh, that are involved in the, Development of uh, agricultural, you know, uh, activities. You know, uh, a, a lot of states, governments have uh, agricultural development uh, uh, agencies. You know, so all of these agencies need to be brought, you know, uh, to the table, empowered. You know, let's let, 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 them, let, them, let them go do, 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 do the brainstorming, you know, of the way forward, you know. And good enough, Nigeria is so blessed. We are so blessed. Harable land, I mean, we have it in abundance. Everything, climate is, I mean, everything is good for us. So, so if bring the experts together, let them, let them, let them, let them brainstorm, you know, and bring, and bring out the blueprint, you know, that we are going to follow. You know, uh, to to get ourselves out out of out of out of, out of, out of the wood. No, don't, don't forget that uh, we, we, used, we used to we used to, we used to be we used we used to be uh, uh, um, one, one, one of the uh, leading countries in in agri uh, uh, production. You know, Malaysia and uh, some of the uh, uh, Asia countries today that are doing very well in oil palm. You know, they we, we, they, they learn from us. You know. Uh, but you see, we, we who taught them a few years back, back. We, are we are now on the back seat, seat. and those, 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 those fellows are making photos, you know, from this. So, 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 so we, we need to bring our experts together, you know, on, 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 on all, all of these fronts, you know, and get this done properly. properly. I mean, yeah, things should be done properly. properly. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Well, 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 Dr. Orebi, you spoke about a holistic approach to the issue of food uh, crisis and hunger in the country as a result of uh, hardship, what would you say as an economist and uh, someone who is vast in uh, the economic uh, sector, how can the federal government ensure that uh, we, we sort of shift our attention away from the oil and gas industry, which has 
in decades done more harm than good to uh, Nigerians and focus on maybe agriculture and go back to the days of the granite pyramids and maybe even better viable options to grow our That's GDP and option. put our, our, economy, our economy back on track. Um, I really <laughs> hope that I heard you well because, like I said, but let, let me just let me just hope that I maybe um, what we can do to get back to the, those good old days uh, where our economy was not depending on oil, you know, and they were doing well. Yeah, if that's what what is on the on the on the board. Yeah, yeah, fine. fine. I mean, a lot, 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 lot of things we can, can do. do. You know, you know um, like, I, like, 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 like I would say, say um, when, when we talk about diversifying our source of foreign exchange, you know, or any, um, it's, it's, also, it's, it's also about, about diversifying our productive, uh, 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 productive uh, base, uh, which of course will lead to diversification of the products we are turning out. Okay? And and that, again, depends on a very fundamental and foundational uh, action line that must be taken if we are, we are going to be seen as serious. You see, and, and that is where, for me, you know, education plays the major role. Education plays the major role. You see, we have neglected education. You know, and, and it's, it's, it's so, so bad. bad. It's, 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 it's not, it's not, you know, for, for the, the good, good of the country. You know, because, because um, um, all of these children, children that, that we are the strength of the nation. nation. You know, and, and when, when they are well trained, they are, they are well equipped. equipped they have they potentials, potentials to contribute, contribute to their, their own quota, quota to national, national growth and development. development. Now, now, you see, see when, when you, when when you train, train these children, children properly, properly, you know, you know research, research and develop, you invest, invest in research, research and, and development. development. They, will they will be able, able to put their, their boxes to use, you know, you know and, and uh, research, research and come out with, with products, products. You know, you know, that, that by, the by the time it's added, added to the basket, basket. You, see you see that, that we'll, be we'll be getting larger and larger. larger. We'll be getting, we'll getting better, better and better. And better. You see, but by the time we abandon these, these children by abandoning uh, uh, edu uh, 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 education, you, you understand, you know, you know we, we lose, lose the product we should be getting from them. I mean, I, mean, I, I always say, say that, that if you look at the, the, the China model, the, and, and the, the, the Asia Tigers, Tigers uh, and, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, look, look at, at India. India. Yeah. Those, Those guys invested heavily in human capacity uh, 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 development. And that is why, why they are yeah, getting the kind of results you know, they are getting. getting. So, so we, we need, need to return to the drawing board. board. That's, That's what I'm saying. saying. We, we need to return to the drawing board. You know, uh, 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 and and uh, and uh, and uh, the, the, from, from primary and secondary schools, you know, you the, know the teachers, teachers need, need to be well equipped, well rewarded, well rewarded so, so that, that they will help, help you know, to, to groom these children, children, you know, and, and also not 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 just grooming them for grooming sake, grooming to discover their potentials and harvest talents for Nigeria. You know, you know, because, because you, you, you discover, discover that, that, you know, you know a, 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 a lot, lot of these students, they carry a lot of potentials, potentials which we are wasting away. away. You know, by, by the time you ignore their teachers, teachers, you know, and they are offending for survival, you know, they will go to this market and go and buy cricket, to go and sell you, and they can make ends meet instead of staying with those children. You know, so Nigeria is losing. Pay them, them very well, well. Reward, reward them very them well. well. Let, Let them stay, stay you know, and, and help to groom this and, and discover the talent that they are carrying, which Nigeria will convert to products. So, so before, before you know what, what is, what is happening, happening, you'll be, you'll be having, having one product, product in addition, addition to the other. To the other.
Well, well, well doctor, doctor, I agree. I agree that it is pertinent to ensure that young people are groomed from an early age. Um, I, I know there are there are technical colleges, there are federal colleges of education, and all of that where people go and learn technical skills. Uh, not everybody has to be, you know, inclined towards uh, the uh, academic uh, aspect of education. However, let's let's move away from that and and take a look at export. Nigeria produces a lot of things that the larger world out there needs. Yet it appears that the only thing that we seem to be exporting is just crude that we end up importing as refined petroleum products. How do we ensure that the, the food produce that comes out from the northern, northern part of the country, what comes out from the southern part of the country, the granites, the, the um, cocoa and, and the likes are exported in large quantities from Nigeria in order to boost our GDP? It's in all of those, all of those, all of those products. That's the point I'm making. We need to invest. It's not just to produce the agriculture. It's not just to produce the, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean to, to, to bring up the agricultural products, the granite, the oil palm, you know. Processing them also. Processing them. Processing them. Uh, we 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 we, 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 we have, have cocoa. We have we have, we have, have granite. granite. There, there are many, many things, things we can, we can bring, bring out of them, them. And, and it, it is, is in training and building capacity on how, how to process those things and, and take, take you know maximize the benefits from them. them. That, that is, is what will lead us out of, of you know the dependence of on the of the nation on the on the oil alone. And in terms and in terms of internal. Uh, production. You mentioned earlier that a lot of companies have, uh, you know, quit Nigeria and exited the country due to one, the uh, continuous dwindle of our currency against the dollar. And secondly, it's becoming more and more difficult for uh, companies to thrive and survive in Nigeria. We saw the likes of GSK and the rest exiting, thereby making the cost of medication very, very expensive in the country. How do we ensure that industries are set up in the country to also help some sectors that are suffering in terms of production so that we don't become an entirely uh, import dependent nation i i, I hope i hope i, I had you well i'm not, I'm not very, very sure, sure. um <laughs> Uh, uh, but but well, well, well I, I was I was talking about manufacturing in the country. If you can hear me, doctor, I was talking about manufacturing and how we can mitigate and close up the gap that the companies that have exited the country due to one issue or the other have left. How do we produce our own uh, um, items, manufacture and you know export as well? Export as well. It is, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is, that, that, that goes down to the, the same thing I was saying earlier on. So it's it's just, we need to develop capacity. capacity. We need to develop capacity. Build capacity, build capacity you know, and we'll produce all the products that we, 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 we need to produce. Uh, we, should uh, we should not shy away from, from the fact that, that uh, you know, you know uh, there, there are days of little beginning. You know, we shouldn't be scared of beginning little and grow. Understand. understand so, so um, um, um the, the journey, journey of a thousand miles, miles begin with a step, step. So, so we should, should be willing to take that one step, step after the other, other you know and we'll get, get to the to the uh, uh, topmost stop, stop you know uh, uh, with, with time, time. So, so build capacity that, that is the, that, that is the basic the baseline build capacity and that is where like i said earlier that is where education still occupy the front seat Education, education take the front, the, 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 the front, front row, row, you know, because, because building capacity, it means that, that Nigeria, Nigeria have to train, train you know, our people, people. have to train your citizens in order, order to know, know what, what to do. do. When, when you, you train them to know what, what to do, do and they, they do, do what they know to do, do Nigeria, Nigeria will benefit from it. Eventually, we will have multiple products everywhere, you know, that both for local consumption and 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 for export. So, so that's the way out. That, 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 that's, that's what, what you know, you know those, those are the high-flying high countries. countries, that's, that's what, what they did. did. So, and, and, uh, and uh, we, we, we can, can do otherwise. So, that's why I keep saying, saying that, that, you know, let's return to the drawing board. Focus on 
on uh, capacity building. That is the way out. Now, now in terms of uh, collaborations uh, between uh, private sector investors and the uh, federal government or government agencies in ensuring that what you have just highlighted right now, uh, capacity building, uh, is encouraged. W what are the roles of these two uh, different uh, key players, the government and the private in investors, in ensuring that there is some sort of synergy to bolster uh, our economy, especially for the good of the common man? In a diversified economy, uh, in, a, in an economy um, where um, we are trying to uh, promote markets, um, and because we know that the market alone you know, will not be able to deliver the goods, so that is why the collaboration between the government and the market is key to driving the economy to the desired uh, 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 goal, you know. Because for every country that have been able to do well, you know, uh, they're, 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 they're strong, you know, involved in the operation of the, of the, of the, of the, of the, collaborating with the, with the, with the, with the, the, the private sector, you know. A strong government. So, and that's where we are also, Advocated, advocated that, that our, our government, government should be strong, be strong in ensuring that, that the necessary atmosphere, atmosphere the necessary environment, the necessary infrastructural base that, that need to be available for the uh, businesses to thrive is provided. provided. You know, and, and if, if that, that is if that, that is done, done then the, the, the businesses, businesses you know will, will be able to to uh, 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 establish themselves you know and uh, and uh, and, uh, and uh, keep running and as long as they they, they, they are they are running so you know uh, um, they will be contributing to uh, out uh, which 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 technically you know will start growing our our income and our and our and our earnings you know and, uh, and uh, which eventually will take us uh, out, out of the world. So, so, so the, 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 the policies, the policies, you know, are in the, in, in, we, we, within, within the ambience of, 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 of government, you know, that will make this, this uh, 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 system, you know, run well. So that is why the government and the, and the uh, need to collaborate, you know, with the private sector in order to ensure that the uh, economic machine is moving well in the right uh, direction. Market, market is good. A market, market alone cannot, cannot deliver the good. So, so that's, that's why, why we need the government to collaborate with the market. market. Well, well, doctor, Thank one you. major um, problem that has bedeviled the country in recent years is that of insecurity, which has made people not to be able to go to their farms. And we also saw reports in the northwestern part of the country where uh, the Badid leader, Turji, was taxing people uh, as high as 30 million naira to 50 million naira as levies for them to be able to access their farms. If we have these issues of insecurity that are forestalling progress in the country, uh, how do we address it? I know that uh, the, the defense chiefs have been asked to move to Sokoto and all, but how do we tackle this head on and ensure that we portray Nigeria as a safe place in the global market and attract investors into the country? What I think, I think uh, we, need we need to, to do, do um, with the security, security problem, problem uh, is that we just need the government to show, you know, uh, itself, you know, as a strong government. Yes, because the government have all the security apparatus of the country under its control. And uh, if that is the case, that means that there should be no information uh, on security matters. That and is it's not, not within the purview of the government. government. So, so, and if, if, if the government have access to all the data, all the all the all the all the information, you know, then the 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 government knows where the problem is actually, you know, very strong and thick. So, the next thing that is is to is to do the right thing, mobilize the right resources in the right direction to do the right thing. 
Uh, no, one, one of the major problems that I think uh, is, is confronting us, and maybe why the uh, insecurity problem uh, may not may, may, may not go 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 away so easily, would be that you know our law enforcement uh, uh, um, uh, uh, group, their morale is is not good enough. Because, because, I mean, you can imagine, how much is a soldier being paid? How much is a police officer being paid? Compared to the risk they are supposed to be taking. In fact, all, all, all right, Doctor, I'm, I'm very, very afraid uh, that this is the much uh, time will permit us to take on this particular segment of the program.